Hey guys, thank you for joining me on my morning walk today, or jog. Um, I am thankful for you guys taking the opportunity to have a moment of silence for all of the people who lost their lives on 9-11. Lately I've had a lot of things in my head and I've been inconsistent in a lot of different ways. Not just here on YouTube, but definitely here on YouTube as well. I don't know, I just got a lot of things on my mind and I think today being 9-11 it kind of brings it all into focus a little bit as well. I started this channel shortly after my wife passed away and the idea behind that was that I wanted to motivate myself to get up and do something every day and hopefully throughout the way I have inspired some of you guys as well to go out and adventure spend time with your family spend time with your loved ones and make life that much better for you and the people around you right now what I've come across lately is that I good morning that I am really struggling with what I feel is the right thing for me to do in life and what I kind of need to do to be able to what's the right word for this you know like the daily grind like work pay the bills and everything because I've truly found my passion here on YouTube so I don't know what I'm going to do maybe I need to sit down and write down a priority list or something like that okay so let me sit down for a moment and so I can talk to you guys properly I think that would be a good thing and it's actually a really nice view right now check it out I feel like right now I have a picture in my head of what I want my life to be but I really don't know how to make it happen. So I really don't know how to deal with this. Um, I'd love some advice from you guys. And because I know, like I tell you guys all the time and that I learned from my wife is that life is way too short to not be doing things that you don't believe in and I think that everybody should be living the life that they were meant to live. <sighs> it's a tough day. I remember 9-11 and it was, I was 18, I was in college. And uh, knowing that all those people lost all those lives kind of makes me put my own life in perspective and that I don't get stuck into that daily grind of needing to just do life things because it's required of me rather than doing life things because I want to. Okay, let's keep on walking. So I've probably brought it up a lot, but I'm not sure if I brought it up enough that with my wife's passing, like I've said it before, she would tell me that she is, she was devastated that she couldn't do the things that she wanted in life. And she would try all the time but her health issues wouldn't allow her and I can tell it how much it hurt her from looking at her eyes and hearing the tone of her voice she was completely genuine about it it's been just over five years since Kristen passed away and I still remember the day that she passed away and after 
the she ended up in the ER room and she woke up for a few minutes I remember how scared she was looking at her eyes and I think at that when she was in that situation she knew that things were turning out for the worst and she didn't want it to happen obviously none of us want that to happen so I'm trying to make it through this vlog <laughs> okay so I had to put the camera down I just can't focus on a lot of things right now but yeah today just thinking about everything really I want to encourage everybody out there to I want to encourage everybody to not have excuses I want to encourage everybody to live their best possible life and don't do things because you feel you have to do them but do things because you want to do them be passionate about the things that you need to do and live your best life because I think we only get one chance and You need to take advantage of it and not let it pass you by because you never know when. <laughs> you never... You never know when it's all going to end. So make the best of what you have today. Be with your loved ones. And live your best life. Uh. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. I... Ah, I've been holding that in for a while. I don't know if it'll end up in the vlog, it probably will, but... <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna finish this run. And... It is really bright, let's adjust the ND filter. Um, I'm gonna finish this run and then I'm going to go to Penny's school because we're invited to go have lunch with them and that is where I want to be today. So I'm going to go have lunch with Penny. Alright, talk to you guys later. Bye.